Okay, so we've all just been chilling outside in the sun, jumping in the pool, all that, and I'm about to make breakfast right now. I've been cutting pretty hard. I've been doing around 2,000 to 2,500 calories a day, trying to get like over 200 grams of protein. So I'm going to show you guys my entire cutting diet today. So we're going to start off with breakfast, which will be four eggs. So. All right, so just finished making breakfast yeah. and we have <laughs> we have four eggs, some blackberries, and then I have a coffee right here. And I've been putting this Fair Life chocolate milk, like half of it, in my coffee. It tastes actually pretty good. And this thing has 30 grams of protein. Yeah. <laughs> Dad and I had a photo shoot yesterday. And the guy we shot with was super cool. He had some like crazy camera setups, lights and everything. And he actually gave me this light setup from Ari. And if you guys don't know what Ari is, they make like all this insane cameras that they shoot movies with. Pretty much like Interstellar, the Batman, like all the Christopher Nolan films are shot on like Ari cameras. So I have this crazy light setup now that I will be using in future videos and stuff probably when I'm back home in Colorado. So yeah, I'm super hyped on that, but right now I'm gonna make my pre-workout meal, which is probably gonna be two packets of oats, which is 300 calories. And yeah, get a little carbs in before I go train. And I'm hitting deadlifts today, so I'm probably gonna stim up relatively heavy so I can have a decent workout. But yeah, let's make up these oats. And the oats are complete. Gonna throw some blackberries in here. Okay, I'm only doing a half scoop of black cherry today because I'll show you what else I'm taking in one second. Now we're gonna take two DMAA pills, which is the serving size, so that has 250 milligrams of caffeine in it right there. And I've been taking DMA in a pretty long time now. I think this is my first time taking it this entire trip since I've been in LA. So two DMA pills with the half scoop of black cherry euphoria. Whoa. Stir this shit up. Devin's actually getting a haircut right now, so I'm just gonna meet him when I get to the gym. So yeah, Jackson and I are about to head over to Zoo Culture right now and hit some deadlifts. You all ready? Mm -hmm. Take the pre. I'm ready to go. Feeling dead. Cuts yeah. hit hard yesterday. Cuts hit. And I walked all the way to the gym. You know what'll make five you five miles? And it'll make you feel good on the cut though. Some of this shit right there. Already had 600 milligrams yeah. of caffeine today. Otherwise, I yeah, oh, yeah. I've also had two coffees and then I just did two of those and a half scoop of pre. So. But I probably had an extra 200 milligrams of just coffee. The the energy drinks, coffees, pre. Yeah, let me this take. DMA, let me save your. Let me take that away from you. Today yeah. yeah, let me take but, it away from you so you don't die first. I'm about to go get my back warmed up, do a few stretches before we hop into the demo session over here. I'm actually watching some YouTube right now. Got Sawyer's deadlift pulled up, 800 from a few years ago at Zoo Culture. So shout out to Sawyer for that. But yeah, let's get warmed up and then hopefully can pull something decent today. 
A fairy tale can cut so deep when you see that it's all lies. You create an honest painting for your disguise. A perfect world, a perfect portrait. A stranger's lips to seal the night. A perfect storm across the shoreline. for a double which is the heaviest I've gone in about a month I'd say so I'm pretty satisfied with that I'm about to drop it to five plates and I'm debating switching over to hook grip in the future but it would be sick to like be able to pull 700 mix grip and I'd still have to relearn how to do hook because I've never really done it before but I might just pull five plates with straps for my volume work just to get used to the double overhand grip so I might give that a try, but yeah, we'll see. I'll decide in a little bit. Okay, so when you pull hook, you're only gonna be doing like maxes, top sets of two, three, hook grip, and the rest of the time you're gonna be pulling with straps. So I was just doing my volume work with straps, but I was even grabbing hook towards the end just to try it out a little bit. But I still have to fully experiment with it. I need to set up further away from the bar because I'm just so not used to doing double overhand. And it is a lot different. So I think I'm still gonna experiment with it the next two sets. But yeah, this is probably the heaviest out of the session I've had since I've been cutting. Look who made it. Yeah, I just got it. What is that? Protein 180 cows. Pop tart? You're gonna deadlift too? Maybe. I might just do back with you guys, honestly. Yeah, I'm trying. I'm trying hook grip like with the straps as assistance. I did 585 for two mixed grip. Then I just got 585 for eight, but it bounces and shifts. Yeah, that's what I meant. It bounces to the side so much it just fucks me up. I want to, but I'm doing sets of eight, so it would just hurt so bad. Nobody does that. That's what I was doing. Damn, bro. So sick. I will. I'll do a single with. Yeah. Okay. I did those two sets with 500. Now I'm actually going back up to 545, and I'm gonna give that a try for my last set.
full day is complete. Devin and I hitting the little sauna at zoo. They literally just have a sauna posted up in the corner of the gym. But it's low-key so nice because if you need to warm up before a powerlifting session like squats or deads, just come in the sauna for like 10 minutes, get nice and warm. I know, that would be so nice. Just like bulking in the winter, come in here, sauna, warm up. Okay, so what? We're gonna run a target real quick? Yeah, that's gonna the plan. Get a couple things, some garlic, onions, for bison, and what else did I say? Uh, some ghosts in like zero calorie uh, soda. All right. Yeah, so we're gonna run a target, pick up a few things, and then I'll show you guys what I'm gonna have for dinner. So. Look at this. This is what happens when you hit a two hour workout and they come in the sauna. Damn. Yeah, that was crazy. Too bad. Okay, so we just picked up a few things at Target and I made dinner right when I got home. So right here we have a pound of bison, a half cup of brown rice, so, and then just some lettuce and basil. And then I'm gonna have this zero calorie Gatorade as well. But I also had a few things I didn't show you guys. I had a couple zero calorie yogurts, which are like 11 grams of protein, 60 calories. And then I also had two Premier Protein Shakes. So I think my total calories came out to like 2,000, 2,100, and 220 grams of protein. So yeah, this is the last meal of the day. And then we'll get up and do the same thing again tomorrow. And if I've sounded a little messed up in this video, it's because I kind of lost my voice the other day. So I've spent dealing with that the past few days. So hopefully that goes away pretty soon. I don't think I'm sick or anything because I'm literally hitting deadlift PRs and feel fine. But yeah, my voice has just been a little fucked up and my nose has been stuffed up. But yeah, thank you guys for watching and that's a full day of eating on the cut and a deadlift workout. So I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out. Let's get it. Fuck, that's hot.